my dear students welcome back to our channel in this video i will be explaining the bcom second semester subject programming with c and c++ as prescribed by usmania university and other universities of telangana we will go through the important questions and answers one by one let's begin with a quick revision unit 2 first important short question is what is an if statement in c answer in c the if statement is like a gatekeeper it checks a condition if it's true the code inside runs if it's false the code is skipped think like this if i study i will pass this is how if works syntax if condition code to run if condition is true example int marks is equal to 75 if marks is equal to 33 print you passed backslash n here since marks are 75 greater than 33 the message you passed will be shown remember use if to make decisions condition should be in code to run goes inside tip to remember if your condition is right your program acts bright next important short question is to what is a break statement in c answer in c the break statement is used to stop a loop or switch case early think of it like saying bus ruko yaha to the program use it when you want to exit a loop early you want to exit a switch case example with loop for int i is equal to 1 i is equal to 5 i plus plus if i is equal to is equal to 3 break print percent d backslash n i output 1 2 here when i becomes 3 the loop stops because of break example with switch int day is equal to 1 switch day case 1 print monday break remember break is equal to exit early from loop or switch tip break helps you avoid unnecessary steps just like taking a shortcut next important short question is 3 what are continue and go to statements in c answer continue statement the continue statement is used inside loops it skips the current loop step and goes to the next iteration example for int i is equal to 1 i is equal to 5 i plus plus if i is equal to is equal to 3 continue print percent d backslash n i output 1 2 4 5 line 3 is skipped next go to statement the go to statement jumps to a labeled part of the program it can move the program forward or backward but use it carefully can make code confusing example hash include studio.h int main go to skip print this will not print backslash n skip print jump using go to backslash n return 0 output jump using go to tip continue is equal to skip this step go ahead go to is equal to jump to a label Next important short question is for what is a loop in C answer in C a loop is used to repeat a set of instructions again and again think of it like this if your teacher tells you to write i will study 5 times will you write the same line 5 times no use a loop types of loops in C one for loop two while loop three do while loop example using for loop for 
int i is equal to 1, i is equal to 5, i plus plus. Print, i will study backslash n. This prints, i will study 5 times. Why use loops? Saves time. Avoids writing same code again. Makes programs short and smart. Tip to remember. Loop is equal to repeat work until done. Next unit 2. Long questions. First important long question is. Explain in detail about conditional statements with examples. Answer. In C. Conditional statements are used to make decisions in a program. Just like in real life we say. If it's raining, take an umbrella. In C, we use conditions to control what happens next in the program. Why use conditional statements? To run some part of the code only if a condition is true. Types of conditional statements. 1. If statement. Runs the code only if the condition is true. int age is equal to 20. If age is equal to 18. Print, you can vote backslash n. Output, you can vote. 2. If else statement. Runs one block if true, another if false. int marks is equal to 40. If marks is equal to 33. Print, Pass backslash n. Else. Print fail backslash n. Output pass. 3. Else if ladder. Used when there are multiple conditions. int marks is equal to 85. If marks is equal to 90. Print grade a backslash n. Else if marks is equal to 75. Print grade b backslash n. Else, print grade C backslash N. Output grade B. 4. Nested if. An if inside another if. int age is equal to 25. If age 18. If age 60. Print adult backslash N. Output adult. Tip to remember. Conditional statements are like traffic signals. If green, go if condition is true. Else red, do something else. Else if yellow, more choices. Conditional statements help your program make smart decisions, just like we do in real life. Next important long question is. To write about if and if else statement with an example program. Answer. In C. If and if else statements are used to make decisions in a program. Just like in real life, we make choices based on conditions. In programming, we use if and if else for the same purpose. 1. If statement. The if statement checks a condition. If it's true, the code inside the if block runs. If it's false, nothing happens. Syntax. If condition. Code runs if condition is true. Example. Hush include stdo.h. int main. int number is equal to 10. If number 0. Print number is positive backslash n. Return 0. Output number is positive. 2. If else statement. The if else statement gives two choices. If the condition is true, it runs the if block. If false, it runs the else block. Syntax. If condition. Runs if condition is true. Else. Runs if condition is false. Example. Hush include stdo.h. int main. int marks is equal to 45. If marks is equal to 33. Print you passed backslash n. Else. Print you failed backslash n. Return 0. Output you passed. Tips to remember. Use if when you need to do something only if a condition is true. Use if else when you have two outcomes, 
one for true, another for false. Easy example from life. If it rains, take an umbrella. Else, enjoy the sunshine. These statements help your program think and decide just like you do. Next important long question is 3. What is a switch statement? Write any example program on it. Answer In C, the switch statement is used to check many conditions easily. Instead of using many if-else statements, we can use switch to make the code neat and simple. When to use? Use switch when you want to match a value with many options. Syntax of switch Switch expression Case value 1 Code block Break Case value 2 Code block Break Default Code if no case matches Example program Let's write a program that prints the day name based on day number. Hush include stdo.h int main int day is equal to 3 Switch day Case 1 Print Monday backslash n Break Case 2 Print Tuesday backslash n Break Case 3 Print Wednesday backslash n Break Case 4 Print Thursday backslash n Break Case 5 Print Friday backslash n Break Case 6 Print Saturday backslash n Break Case 7 Print Sunday backslash n Break Default Print Invalid day number backslash n Return 0 Output Wednesday Explanation The value of day is 3. The switch checks each case. When it finds case 3, it prints Wednesday. Break is used to stop checking further cases. Default is like else, it runs if no case matches. Tips to remember. Switch is great when you have many fixed choices. Always use break to avoid falling into the next case. Use default for safety. Real life example. Think of a food menu. You select option 1 for dosa, 2 for idli, etc. That's how switch works. Next important long question is. 4. Explain in detail about looping statements with examples. Answer. In C, looping statements are used to repeat a block of code again and again until a condition becomes false. Why use loops? To avoid writing the same code many times. Loops make programs short, smart, and fast. Types of loops in C. 1. For loop. Used when you know how many times to repeat. Syntax. For start condition update. Code to repeat. Example. For int i is equal to 1, i happy smiley 5, i plus plus. Print hello backslash n. Output. Hello. 2 while loop. Used when you don't know how many times the loop will run. Syntax. While condition. Code to repeat. Example. Int i is equal to 1. While i is equal to 3. Print i backslash n. i plus plus. Output. i. 3 do while loop. Same as while, but it runs at least once, even if the condition is false. Syntax. Do. Code to repeat. While condition. Example. Int i is equal to 1. Do. Print welcome backslash n. i plus plus. While i is equal to 2. Output. Welcome. Welcome. Tip to remember. For is equal to counted loop. 
while is equal to condition based loop do while is equal to runs once for sure real life example your teacher tells you to clap 5 times you can use a loop to do it loops make your code repeat smartly no need to write the same line again and again next important long question is five differentiate while statement from do while statement with example answer in c while and do while are both loops used to repeat code but there is a main difference between them while loop condition is checked first if the condition is false at the start the loop will not run at all syntax while condition code to repeat example int i is equal to 5 while i 5 print hello from while backslash n i plus plus output nothing because i 5 is false at start do while loop code runs first then the condition is checked this loop runs at least once even if the condition is false syntax do code to repeat while condition example int i is equal to 5 do print hello from do while backslash n i plus plus while i 5 output hello from do while key differences feature while loop do while loop condition check before the loop starts after the loop runs once runs at least once no yes use when you want to check before running you want to run at least once real life example while loop if i have money i'll buy tea do while loop i'll buy tea once then check if i still have money tip to remember while is equal to check first do while is equal to run first check later